you guys. Uh, another final fun. Okay, video. As you can probably tell. And we are going to the sunken temple of Quarum. This is one of the early um, dungeons in the game. But don't worry, I'm level 37. I am actually level 86? I think. Oh, there's a little Lalafell. I found out last night that they are like two foot tall. And I'm just like, okay, so how big are all the other um, ones then? Turns out Elzins are uh, like the second tallest race in the entirety of Erosia. Um, I can't remember which one it is by name, but it's like those big muscular males that you see in the game. Um, they're taller by like a few inches. Oh my god, I have my five ability. Does that mean I have my fire starter? We'll find out, won't we? If you haven't like worked out my thing, it's three, four, two. Until fire starter, and then I get my... Um, I think we need this. Guys, we need to pick up these. Last time I had no idea what the hell those were for. I still don't know what these are for. It's like a doorway or something like that. Oh, I'm firing at the wrong thing. Geek. <laughs> that moment when, like, you want to thingy something, but then you end up aggroing something else. My DPS would also be pretty reduced from what I'm used to. Because I don't have this on unsynced. I don't get what those ones are. But I always like trail behind because I always keep my distance on some of these. It looks like we're running. I will grab this too. Because there is no way I am having you lot run back. Ooh, look, bad guy over there. He looks friendly, doesn't he? Very, very friendly. If you're wondering why I transport a lot, it's so I don't lose a lot of um, my magic, my MP. Because, oh my god. Right, first boss, and I'm pretty sure I died to this guy. Because I don't even know the mechanics. So I'm going to do with those things on the floor. Like these bits here. And I believe there's one over there as well. But we'll see how this, uh, how this takes us. Okay. Because I am pretty sure I died at this fight. But hey, I've only run this once prior to me doing this and that was last month uh, around about November time I had the quest to go do it so I did it yeah my entire quest log is just use the duty finder use duty finder use duty finder use duty finder ah no I just got plus two so reduce my sugar puffs are we 
meant to be stood on this one. Are you sure? No. I just died, dang it. Yes, don't do what I just did. Guys, I'll take care of Alanda Aldemary. I'll wake him up. Everything is fine. You can fight now. Stay strong. Did you just assume my gender? I will wake him up. Mm. I'm gonna like die. <laughs> I'm guessing like jump on and then like run off. What on earth was that? It's like you can't even see what actually hits you. Weakness, strength, dexterity, intelligence, and mind are reduced by 25%. Physical. Okay. Oh god, the tank's dying. Wait, did they go back to the start point? Are you are joking. Shall we? You didn't have a healer then. Oops. Oh, we've now got to run all the way back. Come on, little little guy. Come on, little Lelafel. Who is our tank? Come on. So, guys, I don't just post videos of me successfully doing these with no death. I do die in these. A lot. Oh, I didn't realise there was a treasure coffer there. <gasps> he's just done the biggest thing that I did. He's so hot. He's not, okay. Damn. Anyone who's uh, done this before will know exactly what I'm referring to by enemy of innocence and damn he's hot. Walk on the shiny platform when you have the debuff. When you have the debuff gloom walk on the shiny thing okay that explains what we were doing wrong also the bees one shot okay hey someone knows what they're doing so when you have the debuff of gloom so like when i have the thing that says plus doom why does it say gloom okie dokie And then you move off as soon as it's removed. Get rid of these wasps, wisps. Oh, why did that interrupt? I didn't move. Yeah, thing about black mages is you cannot move. Right, glowy platform. Now we move off the glowy platform. Right, there's a glowy platform again. Looks like we're doing this. Oh. Right, glowy platform is this one. There we go. Long time to log in. What? Ah, oh, some maintenance in two hours from now. Oh shh. It. Don't queue up for dungeons in two hours time, peeps. Right, this guy is gonna die now. Open up the treasure coffer. I don't need any of this. Why am I opening the treasure coffer? Um, I'm adding stuff to my stuff. I don't know what I'm adding it to, but apparently I'm adding it to something. Apparently there's maintenance in two hours. Great, that's me being bored all night because I slept earlier. Yeah, probably play Conqueror's Blade or something. If you guys haven't seen me do that, well, play it, uh, there's a video that I recently uploaded. Yes, the audio is poop. And that's because the mic's a bit 
dodgy at the minute. Um, not sure what the other half's done with it. It seems fine in Discord when I'm talking to friends. Must just be um, the stuff. Oh yes, with this one, I believe those big blocks you have to kill on top of a platform to open up the doors. These guys aren't really focused on that stuff, apparently. The reason why I am running as well is because I cannot cast and move at the same time. It is bull. Last time I was in a dungeon on a different game, I didn't move and everyone was like, why have you stopped moving? I'm like, I am in Final Fantasy mode right now. Don't judge me. I've gotten so used to not moving when I spell. But yeah. Oh, it's fun. Oh, next boss is right there. The Condemned. Ugh. I've gotten so used to fighting forbidden something of something, depending on what the thing is. But yeah, as you can see, I've just finished Shadowbringers. Oh, Endwalker, here I come at some point. I haven't started Endwalker because I'm on the post Shadowbringers stuff. Which is like a little bit in between each expansion. And I don't exactly want to ruin it, but I'm on a mission to save people. Oh, wait. I'm the warrior of light. Isn't that like the main thing anyway? Is I. I save people? <laughs> I help people? I put people before me? Oh, wait. <laughs> yes. Right. So we need to take out that gemstone anywhere with this. And then we can attack the guardian when it's down. If I unsync this, I'd be able to one-shot all this. But one, I don't know how to unsync stuff. And apparently it's like the only way that you can um, solo these dungeons is by unsinking. Because yeah, doing all this with one person, you would die multiple of times and not be able to complete it. So, yeah. Especially on a freaking black mage or thamatage. I might actually like change my class at some point. I try Reaper. Pass, because I don't need it. I didn't even check what that was. It's a pants of resilience. Okay. Guys, I wouldn't go all the way up because, um, yeah. Okay, never mind. We can go all the way up. I've gotten so used to like seeing the stair thing and like having screen go black on me for a moment while it loads in the next section. If I was leveling up some other thing and but using my black mage, I would try and work out what I'm leveling up and then be like, yeah, I need that. Blocky, blocky, blocky needs to go over there. Yep, right there. Oop. Oh, um, the fuck was that? So there's a stone pedestal over there. I don't think we use those. I 
Unlock the little guy. I'm more thinking about like seeing Lalafells than I am like cat people or like humanoid, like full size, because I barely ever see Lalafells. Unless, of course, they're like dancing about in the towns. And then we're just like, you guys are creepy. And then we have little Nanimo. And we're just like, please don't cry. You'll make me cry. You just feel for her because she's just like, you are so adorable. Take, I want to take you home. And then you get a wind up Nanimo. And you're just like, oh, my dreams have come true. I will be your Luban. Cry on my shoulder. <laughs> yeah. Right. So here is why we need all the stuff. And I'm not sure if I've picked up all of them or not. The scales of judgment. I don't know how to do this, so eek. Someone who does, please. Right, Arexi is going off for the night. That's just my free company chat. Um, yeah, it's like midnight here, as you can tell by the clock in the top right. Right, whoever knows how to do this, do it. So we've got one there. And then, oh, oh, did we get it wrong? <laughs> Damn, she's the fastest logger offer in the Wild West. <laughs> Funny, I pressed the wrong button there. When you know that you can type because you're a magical caster. It's just great. Oh, we have a cutscene. Okay, I'll let you guys watch it. Ooh. Um Hi. Right, and they're all waiting because he. We look like such a badass gang. Hey, well, let's just get this guy thingied. I'm pretty sure these boards will probably light up as well. I've just noticed that we've got a lancer. Oh, these have got to get on there. Okay. Um, where are we putting you? Oh, that hit harder than I thought it would. Eek. These things, oof, okay. Get you gone. Um, excuse me. Oh, I ran out of MP. That would help. Yeah, those things are painful. Oh. Keep running out of MP. Ow. I must notice that I'm not doing any damage to that just then. Ooh. Just landed on me. That was not nice. Oh, God. Can we, like, maybe not jump on me? I need a nice space. Ekalili, 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 ekalili. I don't know why I'm saying ekalili, but hey. Oh, I missed that. Right, we'll take out you. Why am I. Right, we've got those down. I need to move. I'm like the only one that's focused on this because eek. Right now we just need to deal with that last one. 
Well, no, don't. Okay. <laughs> I've just finished the second trial expansion and it made me remember why pugging is not fun. GG. Okay, and I think we'll do the play accommodation on this little guy. If, you know, he hasn't just run off. Uh, play accommodation of you. And I don't need any of this. Okay. So guys, uh, stay safe. Explore Rosia. And uh, peace out.